Hey, Sadie here at home quarantine in Santa Barbara, California. And I wanted to bring you a sanity and success tool to help balance this chaotic and unknown time, which we are all going through right now. Now, during this time, I see a lot of people, whether they're fitness professionals or creatives or just people, veering wildly from end of spectrum, end of spectrum to polarity and polarity. And the two ends of this spectrum I'm talking about are either completely shutting down, being confused, not knowing what to do now, letting fear and anxiety take over, uh, eating things too consistently that maybe you shouldn't or wouldn't normally to lose your fitness progress and just kind of, you know, it's like all or nothing and that area is nothing. Uh, you Netflix and chill for hours and hours and really don't get much done. And it's totally understandable right now to be in that space. I get it. The other polarity seems more productive, but actually is just as destructive if you're only doing that. And that is overworking hyper stimulation, uh, hyper drive work on anything and everything just to feel like you're getting something done. But what that tends to do is drain you and cause fatigue and overload in another way, just like the other polarity. Well, there's a seed of power in both of those. And I want you to pluck out that seed of power and bring them both into center. So this is a wild and wonderful dance you can do right now at home while you are in your stay at home state too. And that is to find a balance, just like we never want to only inhale or only exhale, <laughs> that would work, that squeezes the life out of us. I want you to let your daily rhythms breathe to find the balance between chilling and completing. And that means that instead of all the actions you could take, you want to start sitting down with yourself, getting clear, uh, compartmentalizing your day to help you get to the actions that will move your life forward, that will help you complete your real goals, your real dreams to envision new ways of doing things so that now you can stay successful and continue to build on the growth and evolution that you've been doing so far in your life, but maybe in a new way. When the gateway is open and we're all able to go out and do more and more, you're going to be ready to go right out of the gate with more clear thinking, more direction, more success. But to also balance that with chilling with taking the pause, with resting and restoring yourself, taking times to self-nourish, to sleep if you need to, to give yourself a break, and yeah, to Netflix and chill, and uh, you know, eat the tacos, do, do the things, but not all the time. To do work and align your actions toward your goals, but not all the time. To make that space and release what's unnecessary right now, so there is breathing room around your work your play and your rest. And there is a way to do it even in this really interesting and challenging time. Let me know if this speaks to you at all, if it resonates with you to find that breathing rhythm. Have you been veering too close to one or the other polarities too often? And how can you reinvent yourself now in a new way so that you're staying creative, productive, and passionate right now too? All right, thank you so much for listening. I'll see you soon.